Dixon back to third. Tala Takuma Sato now in the second place. He has split up that target party. Can Takuma Sato be the one to take the four quarter trophy? Mark James to you. Takuma Sato trying to reel in the number nine machine of Scott Dick or Dorio Frank Kitty is saying exit turn number three. It is Takuma Sato about a 10 car length disadvantage now. He's in second. He is behind the leader, Dario Franchitti, looking for win number three. The white flag is out. Takuma Sato, the Ray Hall, let him the Lanigan driver. Now pulling up on the leader, Dario Franchitti. Will he make the move? No, he'll crash in turn number one. Jake Perry, Sato crashes, trying to make the pass for the lead on the final lap of the race. Dario Franchitti got through that, and Takuma Sato did not. Dario Franchitti, assuming he can keep those hands on the wheel and the fuel holds up, is about to become a three-time winner at the Indianapolis Motor Speedway. Dario, but right now, here they come down the front straightaway. And Dario Franchitti up, is going to join uh, an elite group as he is going to become a three-time winner at Indianapolis. What a race. What a race. this year what does it mean to win the indianapolis 500 today i just want to dedicate this to uh two of indianapolis's finest dan weldon and michael wanzer um uh, thank you to all the fans for saluting our buddy dan today and, uh, um, that, what a race what a race um, i think dw would be proud of that one just coming from the back there and that last lap Running side by side with Takuma, we, I went down and I moved up to give him the room and then we hit and I just kept a foot and, and managed to keep it out of trouble. But thank you to this target team uh, and my buddy Scott Dixon. And I was looking there at the pole and I was thinking, I don't know who the heck's going to win it. But everybody up there was a friend of Dan's and I think that about sums it up. Every, everybody loved Dan. In the battle at turn one with Sato, how did you decide which line to take and what to do as he pressured you from the inside? Well, now that we're allowed to defend our position, there's a, there's a kind of a gray area. So I moved over and I saw he was coming and I was actually, I'd come over as he moved. So I came back over and I moved up the track and I don't know, he got loose. It looks like I just saw the replay. He got loose underneath me, but uh, Kind of reminds me of Emerson and Little Al there with the, the contact at the end and Scott Harner, my spotter, is on there going, keep going, keep going, keep going. And I'm, I'm trying, I'm pulling gears. And I gotta say, thank you to Honda as well. We had a really tough qualifying and these guys worked so hard. And at every race I've won, every IndyCar race has been with Honda. They worked so bloody hard and showed everybody they could do today. So thank you. This is, I mean, this, this means the world. This is Indianapolis, man, and three times and my, you know, to be on the on the trophy beside Dan, either side, that, that that's more important than anything. Dario, you're an astute student of the sport of racing. What does it mean to be among those that are three-time winners at Indianapolis? Well, the last week I've been studying my buddy JR's uh, Johnny Rutherford's book because he gave me the other night left a beautiful inscription in it, and uh, said he hoped to welcome me to the three-time club. So. Uh, to, to be in the company of guys like that just means so much. And um, JR gave me a little wave the first time I led under caution today. He did, we have a little ritual here and he came up and gave me a wave. So I waved back and uh, 
then we went racing again. But what a, what a, a great race today. He was able to come from the back of the grid when after getting hit in pit lane and spun. And um, again, I can't say enough about this target team and the, and the adversity they've been through. And uh, you know, Dan was Dan was our guy. Michael was was our boy, and and, and we just dedicate this to him. And uh, and that feels really quite nice right now. <laughs> It's a hot day at Indianapolis. Nobody hotter than Chip Ganassi Racing and Dario Franchitti, who gets a hug from his father as he celebrates his third victory at the Indianapolis 500-mile race.